Hi there everyone, welcome to Nigi Tech. Today we are diving into Apple latest powerhouse, the 2024 Mac Mini powered by Apple Silicon M4, the same chip that drive the recently announced iMac. For those who are not aware of, Apple also recently announced iMac. So if you want to buy all in one PC, then check out the iMac video that I have created in the description of this one. Now coming back to Mac mini, which is now powered by Apple and 4 and the biggest change that you're going to see aesthetically in Mac mini is in terms of size. The new Mac mini look much more compact than its predecessor. And here you can also see Apple itself talk about size down and power up. And this new Mac mini will be available from 8 November. So now let me click here on learn more to see the complete tech spec. And here you can also see this new Mac mini just start from Rs 59900, which I would say really a great deal. And on the top of it here, you can see you can also avail 4000 rupees instant cash back on Mac mini plus 12 months of no cost EMI, making it a really a lucrative deal if somebody would like to buy an Apple computer. And one should not think of if you are getting it at this kind of price and the size of this Mac mini is now not that big because as I said, it is now powered by Apple latest M4 chip. And the good thing here is um, unlike iMac, let me also showcase you spec of iMac, which basically comes with um, eight core M4 chip. But here in case of Mac mini, you gonna get 10 core CPU, which is really awesome guys, because this translate that the base Mac mini will be faster than base iMac. And this base iMac is more than double the price of mac mini so really it is a great value for money and not only that one thing that we can see now improve is at least 16 gigabyte of ram even in case of base mac mini which is very important i guess for apple intelligence just like with iMac, the Mac mini is a part of Apple vision to make intelligently easy. And as of today, you will see a lot of writing and creativity tools embedded directly into the latest Mac OS Sequoia. Now, apart from that, if we talk about storage, unfortunately, storage is still starting from 256 gigabyte which is really low on size you will not realize when your whole 256 gigabyte storage get filled off so this is a thing that i feel that still where mac mini is lagging behind but the good thing here is you can buy external storage and can keep or segregate a data file let's say in external drive and program files in your system and here we can see if we talk about the display support the Mac mini really step things up into multiple display setup. So here we can see it can support up to three display. So um, if we talk about IO, I think it comes with only one HDMI, but there are Thunderbolt ports that one can utilize to connect more number of display. So here we can see it says that it can support two display with up to 6K resolution at 60 Hertz over Thunderbolt and one display with up to 5k resolution which again over thunderbolt or 4k resolution at 60 hertz over hdmi so we can see here the thunderbolt port which are the smaller port are actually offering even higher capability or capacity of showing even higher resolution than hdmi as these thunderbolt 4 port support native display port 1.4 output over usb-c which is really nice and if someone upgrade for this m4 pro chip which is this one then they may also see the capability of thunderbolt 5 which is equivalent to display port 2.1 output which is really great as here you can see it can support up to 8K resolution at 60 Hz or 4K resolution at 240 Hz, which is really nice to see. Um, and then it is also equivalent to HDMI 2.1. Now, apart from that, here you're also going to get this headphone jack. And then if we talk about IO, here we can see on the front 
we're gonna see two USB type C port with support of USB 3.0 that is up to 10 Gbps of speed then uh, the headphone jack that we talk about and um, if we talk about the back side here you can see um, in case of normal M4 we're gonna get this gigabit ethernet port which is this one and the good thing here is these ports are configurable up to 10 Gbps of ethernet so uh, which is really nice to see because even in case of PC motherboard uh, you will see they offer only 1 GB of ethernet and at max 2.5 or 5 gigabit of ethernet but here with mac mini you're gonna get this 10 gigabit of ethernet then we're gonna have sdmi in both and then three additional thunderbolt port with up to 40 gbps of speed however if you go for m4 pro here you're gonna get three thunderbolt 5 port that can go up to 120 gbps so I would say in terms of number of port, both M4 powered and M4 Pro powered are same. However, the difference is only uh, when we talk about M4 Pro, you're going to get this newer Thunderbolt 5 port. And remember guys, these three ports are additional to these two port that one will see on the front. So basically you're going to get five ports. However, the only downside I would say here is you are not going to get any usb type a port so you may need to buy a dongle or connector if you have got devices or peripherals that have got usb type a interface then um, if we talk about communication then you can see a typical wi-fi 6e bluetooth 5.3 and then ethernet that we already talked about and then here we can see uh, the size which got reduced as if I compare this M4 powered Mac mini with a previous generation of Mac mini here we can see we're gonna get a bump in specs and as I was mentioning about the size here the newer version is slightly more height but if we talk about the width here we can see it is only 5 inches or 12.7 centimeter compared to previous version which was 7.75 inches or around 19.7 centimeter which is really quite size reduction when compared to last generation of mac mini and then a uh, one more good thing here we can see is there is a direct jump from m2 to m4 and obviously uh, you will see the benefit of it while you are playing with all these apps that comes built in with your mac mini and that's all guys from my side in this video i hope you found this video helpful and informational if so then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to negitech for more pc and accessories related videos also let us know in the comment what are your thought on mac mini 2024 Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Till then, you take care and bye-bye.